in just under three minutes, you will understand how you can integrate Cloud AI with Power BI. And here, MCP is an open source standard for connecting AI applications to external systems. So we are going to use Power BI MCP server, which uses the same specification model a context protocol and it will create a seamless connection between AI agents and Power BI semantic models as shown in the diagram. Um, using a natural language query, a developer can interact with the data set using Cloud AI and you can do a lot of things uh, as listed there. And you can install uh, using uh, Visual Studio Code and you can install GitHub Copilot, etc. and follow the instructions. And alternately, you can do a manual install. You can download the file, rename the file uh, to .zip and unzip the contents to a folder and run that particular executable. And once you do that, and you can copy the MCP JSON registration from this uh, console and register it in your uh, AI tool. In our case, it will be Cloud AI. You can connect to all those three different uh, semantic models housed in those different environments. And if I click on this executable on my local machine, uh, this window will open up. I need to copy this and uh, save it in the config file of uh, my cloud installation. Usually it is there in the app data folder in Windows machine. And once I do that, my configuration is also ready. Prior to jumping into it, uh, let us try to look at Cloud AI. And you can uh, sign up with Cloud AI by using your email. After confirmation, you can uh, start using it. There are uh, different uh, pricing plans. Uh, there is a free tier and a pro and max. Based on your needs, you can use it. And I've downloaded a Cloud AI desktop onto my uh, laptop here so that I could uh, start using a Cloud AI to uh, interact with my local Power BI installation. Once you follow the instructions, uh, your window might look like this, Cloud AI desktop window. And I can start uh, um, using prompts here. I can say that uh, you um, connect to Power BI desktop and uh, once that instance is up and running, the Power BI desktop file and uh, Cloud AI will start interacting, try to use the connection properties, etc. And once it is uh, seeing that instance, it will connect to that uh, particular file. And I can use any other prompt. I can say that, hey, can you check to see if any of the measures which I have created in that report have any errors? Um, this is, we are just trying to scratch the surface. You can use it much more effectively. But uh, this is how uh, I have uh, used my prompt and I've got the response. So uh, it's a good idea to integrate uh, Cloud AI with Power BI Desktop and start interacting with your data set and uh, try to use AI effectively.